So yes, Sims knows very well that the game is broken. So I'm going to show you some people commenting on the Sims uh, page about the game being broken. This one says they're not until the game is properly fixed going to buy anything. There's a lot of people saying this and I'm one of those people. This one says since the update you cannot travel to a lot with the off the grid trait. So this repair that they had done was supposed to fix a lot of the bugs across many packs and the base game created new bugs. This person says yesterday's update broke my game even more. It's unplayable now. Loading HH glitch still there and infinite loading screen. I'm officially done with the game and will be uninstalling and just keep up with the news. This person, thanks to the laundry list that they update that they did, their game is doing this. Actually, a lot of people are reporting that. This one is saying, I can't pay my bills because their utilities are shut off, but every option to pay bills doesn't work. This one's very concerning. Just had the nanny flirt with one of my child sims. Never noticed it before, but can this be removed in the programming of the game or something. Having the nanny flirt with the child sims is disgusting. This one says, I'm getting a bunch of pixelation stuff that caused my game to crash since the last update. She said, again, not buying until the game has a major fix of all the current issues with all the existing packs and actually is able to make the game run without constant lag issues. Eduardo says, after these new updates, this was eight hours ago, every prizes from the Happy at Home event are gone. I haven't even checked that. Well, that's a bummer. EA. Someone says it's really lagging on the game. The game is crashing and bugging out since installing these new updates. This person says their game doesn't even load. It cuts off at the Sims 4 screen. Yeah, that's had loading problems too. Danielle says, please tell me EA has fixed the resume save bug after the update. I'm dying to play with these kids. True says, fix the PlayStation bugs. My Sims struggle to follow tasks. I'm having the same thing. You give them a command, it goes in the queue and instantly disappears. And then they don't get completed. This one, she said, I'd rather like the reward items back you stole in the update. So this is multiple people complaining about the reward items disappearing, which I haven't even checked yet. Oh my word! According to EA Answers, it's happened to thousands of people. I am not buying anything until you give everyone back what you stole. Boy, this person's mad. I don't blame them. This person says, my game keeps crashing every time I try to make my sim do anything. The time freezes and no one moves. Oh yeah, a whole lot of freezing going on. This person's just letting them have it. It is completely abnormal to pay for software that breaks down with each mandatory update. We pay for software that should work normally without any admin, handling, coding, or anything else. On consoles, does EA Game also suggest writing lines of code to debug updates? This is ridiculous. Sorry, I'm not a tester for EA Game. Everyone has their own job. Or just stop making them dismiss and don't release updates. Not cordially, an exasperated user, and I'm thinking of taking this to a lawyer. Mm -hmm. Class action lawsuits, I, I do believe that there is valid basis for one because they are selling faulty products and know they are. Anyone else really lagging on the game, crashing, bugging out since the new updates? This one says, my game doesn't even load, cuts off the Sims 4 screen. I think I read that already. Ness says, no more new content. Focus on repairing your own games. This one doesn't like the new yellow green they added to CIS. And says it's almost unplayable. Not happy. This person can't even load her home lot. Says it's crashing. She's only had one sim or crashing because it's a tiny home lot. Didn't have the time to suss it out. This one says still not showing up on her shop. All these complaints are just from one post.